Trial Surface Card Trial Surface Board Setting up the VSD Controller's Modbus Card The device is intended for collecting, processing, displaying and transmitting the parameters of an electric submersible pump installation. Thanks to effective algorithms for requesting the status of sensors and data management systems. TM01 provides continuous monitoring of the equipment status and allows timely decisions to be made to optimize the performance of the monitored equipment. We are confident that TM01 will allow you to maximize wall production. In this video tutorial, we will show you how to set up the VSD controller for reading parameters from the Trio Surface Card and the Trio Surface Board. Step 1. Setting up the communication between the Trio Surface Card and the Trio Surface Board and the VSD controller. The instruction manual must be used when setting up the communication of the Trio Surface Card and the Trio Surface Board with the VSD controller. An electronic version of the manual can be downloaded from our website by following the link or by scanning the QR code in the datasheet. Step 2. Download and review the manual. Download the user manual from the Trio Surface Card or the Trio Surface Board. Follow the link on the screen. Click on Trio TM01 Submersible Measuring System. You will see the Trio TM01 Surface Equipment. Click on Download the PDF file. After downloading the manual, open page 59, where the Modbus card on the Trio Surface Card is located. The Modbus card on the Trio Surface Board is on page 63. Here it will show you how to configure the connection to the Trio Surface Card. Page 59 shows the basic parameters for receiving data from the Trio Surface Card. The default parameters to be entered on the controller are as follows. 19,200 baud, device address 68, 8 bytes of data, no parity, one stop bit. Step 3. Configuring the VSD controller's Modbus card, episode 1, your controller. Before setting up the communication protocol, you need to have the Trio surface card connected to your device via an RS-232 or RS-485 communication interface. A video of the connection can be accessed via the link. Go into the controller software. First, set the port as Modbus Master, then set the baud rate. The default setting is 19,200 baud, or 19.2 kilobytes. Configure the pre-key and post-key parameter. Enter values of 2 milliseconds in both parameters. Set it to 8 bits set parity to none, and operate one stop bit at a time. Next, proceed directly to setting the parameters. Configure the first parameter, receiver temperature. Enter a name for the parameter. Specify the network address of the Trio surface card as 68. This can also be changed in the settings of the unit itself. First number, Specify the function. Use the third or fourth function to read out the parameters. The third function is used to read storage registers and the fourth function is used to read incoming registers. Use the fourth to clear selected parameters. Use the programmer's calculator to enter the Modbus register. Open the calculator and convert the temperature receive address 0x2021 from hexadecimal, H-E-X, to decimal, D-E-C. Add 1 to change from address to register. Address begins with 0 and register with 1 and enter the resulting value, 8226, on the line. For this controller, set a resolution of 1 to 1. For other controllers, see the Modbus card for each parameter. The scale is from 0 to 65535. Leave the other parameters at their defaults. One of the parameters is now set. Follow the same procedure for the other parameters you require. 1. Enter a parameter name. 2. Specify the function. 3. Convert the address value to decimal notation and enter the resulting value. 
Once you have done this, you will see the value of the parameter on the program screen and on the controller screen. In this case, it is not possible to set the discreteness of the parameter. Episode 2 The UMK-A03 Controller Now we will show you the connection setup with another controller, UMK-A03. Go to the Telemetry menu, then Telemetry Setup. To connect, select Transfer in the Communication Protocol parameter. If this protocol is selected, the device address and baud rate will be set automatically. Go to the Auto Setup parameter, select Yes, and press Enter. All parameters from your Triol Surface Card or Triol Surface Board appear on the controller screen. Episode 3 The UMKA07 Controller Setting up the UMKA07 is as simple as setting up the UMKA03. Select Startup in the side menu. Then click on Telemetry in the top menu. Then go to Telemetry Selection. On the screen, you will see the telemetry settings. Set the Modbus address to 68 and the port speed to 19.2 kilobytes. Select RS-232 or RS-485 port type according to your connection. In this case, it's RS-485. Once you have made all the settings, go to the Auto Set parameter, select Yes, and press Enter. All parameters from your Triol Surface Card or Triol Surface Board appear on the controller screen and your setup is ready to go with full control of all parameters for safe and long operation. Work with Triol. Sell knowledge.